My pappy always said, faint heart never filled a flush. It ain't your pappy's money. Fold. That leaves you and me. What are you holding, Mr. Lash? It'll cost you another 500 to find out. Oh, four kings and an ace. Well, now that's a mite perplexing, seeing as I got four aces and a king. Well, I got the gun. A lot of that going around lately. Seems like a waste of a good-sized pot. How about we split it and both walk away? How about I keep it all? Sounds fair the way you explain it. The technology's from the future. Wait. We don't know how things work here yet. Hang him at dawn. Don't I get a trial? Sure. You're guilty. My town, my rules. Wait a minute. Can't we talk about this? How about another hand? Double or nothing? I think we know how things work here now. We have to help that man. That's not what we're here for. Someone's tampering with history. The stakes are much bigger than the life of one card sharp. Then it's settled. We'll break them out after sundown. <clears throat> That's not going to work. I tried it. Yeah, those bars are cheap pig iron, but they're plenty strong enough to hold. At least until morning when they come to hang you. Do you mind? I'm trying to plan an escape over here. How's it going so far? I'm working on it. Quiet right down in there. That's just what I was telling him. I'll get the door. Or that. I'd get out of town if I were you. I'd like to, but my pappy always said, a man who sticks his head in the sand makes a pretty good target. I got business to conclude before I leave. Bartholomew Aloysius Lash. Friends call me Bat. Bat Lash. 